Hey everyone, I just want to do a follow up on this um, Batman case right here. This is the one from Oats Basif, Oats B A S F, and give you guys my thoughts on using this case for every single day for the past almost two weeks now. So, first, I want to make some corrections. When I did the unboxing on this case, the white carbon fiber, I, I said was a white fiber, carbon fiber skin for your phone, it came with, it's not white carbon fiber. It's actually uh, a translucent carbon fiber, so you can put it on your note, and then if you have a blue or a note or a black note or the lavender note, nine it'll have the color of that with the carbon fiber pattern i didn't use it on my phone i put it on this uh case right here this is my color gradient case that i got way back when and that's what i'm using it with right now or what i put it on instead of my phone because my phone my note nine has this uh color gradient skin that I got from slick wraps as you can see here although it's probably not showing as well the color gradient and I've been enjoying this color gradient skin for man for as long as I've owned my note I got this um, color gradient skin I first had a blue carbon fiber skin from D brand and then I saw this skin on Slick Wrap's website and then I got it. So now I want to show you guys this. I got another um I got some more skins from Slick Wrap. And they had uh Slick Slick Wraps had a sale um the week before Memorial Day that they were offering a uh, 70% off on all their skins um, before Memorial Day or even on the day of Memorial Day and I ordered these skins um, like that Thursday or Friday before Memorial Day weekend and I just got it in I just got these skins in today so the positives from Slick Wraps is that they always have a sale going on unlike um, D brand but man, their shipping process is so slow. I got a two-day, I paid for extra two-day delivery, okay, priority mail from United States Post Office. And that was, I made my order, like I said, Thursday or Friday before Memorial Day, which was a Monday. And I'm now just getting these in today. That is freaking slow. It's like, once they, once you put in your order it takes them almost a week maybe to process your order and then and only then does it get delivered and so see as you can see here it says priority two day mail but it's been almost more than almost two weeks since uh i ordered this and now i just got it two days my butt slick wraps you guys need to get your sh your stuff together. I was going to say something bad, but I corrected myself. You know, your SHITs together. Anyways, this is the slick wrap skins, and I'm going to show you why I got these skins. Um, they have this, like, these superhero or I forgot what they call it, Helmetica uh, design and everything. So let's just take this out of the envelope, and I'm going to show you what I got. I got Superman right here and see the blue on this Superman and the blue color will go and match exactly with my Blue Note 9. You guys don't really need to see this. This is the receipt. And then uh, so normally these these skins are like $19 but all, all together with the 70% uh, discount and the $8 or extra $10 extra for two day priority shipping it cost me like 19 bucks like like if I would have just paid for one skin and so here's Batman right here and you guys probably obviously know why I got Batman because now the Batman 
um, skin is going to go with this Batman bumper. Uh, bumper, metallic bumper case or metallic bumper for the Note 9. Now, overall, I have enjoyed using this uh, bumper. The only thing I didn't like, the main thing I didn't like, is the one main thing what I liked about it is this. This back part, I love that you can use the kickstand features on this, but number one, you can't use um, wireless charging no more. And then number two, I can't put it on my dock that's inside my car. My um, regular dock that I have, it like it's an IATI and it just clamps to the back of the phone like this. But now that um, I have this extra kickstand part right here, it doesn't fit all the way through. I mean, it'll hold, but it doesn't seem like a secure hold, so I can't use that dock no more. So I had this other thing in my car um, where it just hangs off of a, like a, one of those um, plastic hooks, and it hooks onto this part, and that's how I use it now. So that's the only negative, is this part right here is the positive and the negative because... It's good for the kickstand features, but it's not so good for wireless charging and using a, a car dock. And then um, the other thing I didn't like was because it's mostly just your phone on the sides. And this phone is metallic. It can get kind of slippery if your hands are sweaty or whatever like that. So that are the those are the one things I... Um, did not like and did like about this uh, bumper so man I am really I'm torn but uh, that I I'm gonna take off this skin because I love this skin right here I might have to order another one but we'll see because I know pretty soon the note 10 is coming out I'm going to remove so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to remove this skin this color shifting skin, which I love so much when, since I first got this uh, Note 9. And then I'm going to put the Batman skin on and show you guys how it looks with this uh, Batman metallic bumper. So I'm going to remove the skin. And normally I do my installation in the bathroom with hot running water in the shower so to prevent dust. But I'm going to do it, I'm going to try to attempt to do it here on camera for the first time and show you guys how I normally put the skins on these, um, on my Note 9 or on my, any of my phones. Okay, so as you guys can see, I removed my color gradient skin and just for if you guys are curious, here is my other uh, Slick Wraps skin. This is their blue carbon fiber. And here is my D brand blue carbon fiber that I had the first time out. And when I remove this, it still looks like it's a new skin. So I think the vinyl on these uh, D brand is a better quality than the ones on the Slick Wraps because right here, is where I tried to put peel it off on this corner and look look what what happened it almost like tore this corner part just for me to remove this um, color gradient skin where on the D brand it's like there's nothing that you could see like if it uh, you could it looks like you could reapply it again you know if the back part the sticky part will still um, stay on your phone so here is the Slick Wraps um, blue carbon fiber that I got and I've never even used because I just loved this uh, skin so much. And then um, put those all aside. So we're going to get this, uh, break out this, um, the Batman one first. And I'll probably put the Superman on later on. Now one thing I do notice and I haven't I didn't see anything inside the envelope is uh when I got the the color gradient and the carbon fiber skin it I got this uh like my microfiber cloth this time out I don't think I got one 
Maybe it's in between the, it's sandwiched in between the two skins, but we'll find out. These uh superhero series or Hel Helmetica series, what they call them, um, they come in two varieties. You get glossy, and uh, they have. They have glossy and um, what's the other one? Matte. Is it matte or non-glossy? Just to say glossy and not glossy. Oh, okay, here it is. So here's the um, here's the other microfiber cloth right here. So I have two now, but I don't really use these. Um, then you get these. What are these extra? These uh, the top and bottom. Um, skins for the for these uh for these uh stickers the only thing is um i've never installed the side skins or the top and bottoms because if you want to use a case now well well now i probably could if i'm if i'm using this bumper if you want to use a case like say where's my note nine like like a traditional case, like this uh, Galaxy Note 9 OEM uh, bumper case. If you try to install a case or try to, if you install these top and bottom and sides skins and then you install, try to install a, the phone or put the phone inside of the case, these will, these sides and tops and bottoms will come off. I've never had one that stayed on if I try to put a case on it. So just be forewarned about that if you're thinking about putting the top and bottom of any skins whether it's from D brand or slick wraps so let's see here's my note 9 um, I think I wiped it down wish it would have came with like some uh, alcohol wipes but it doesn't so I'm just gonna wipe it up right here Try to remove some of the extra, some of the sticky stuff from from um from my previous skin. This one right here. And yes, I did keep the the color gradient here on the uh, camera lens. And why not? I mean, let me see. Look at this right here, see? This Batman thing where it has this part, it's gonna match with this part right here, right? So I'm not I'm probably not even gonna put that black color gradient. And oh yeah. I don't know why it would have a um sticker for your fingerprint sensor because if you put the sticker on, it's gonna mess with your fingerprint sensor. So I wouldn't recommend that either. Okay, so here is how you would install it. Um What I do, and uh, I follow the instructions that came from. Um, man, this table is slippery, so I'm gonna put a. I'm gonna put my towel, a carbon fiber towel underneath here. Whoops! Damn, I keep hitting my camera. So I'm gonna go like this, so my phone won't be that slippery. Let's see. Am I still focused? Okay, so here we go. So what you want to do is you don't really want to take, remove the whole sticker off of this, uh, this uh, non-stick backing or whatever. You just want to remove half of it and line it up with the camera lens. And before you, you know, before you remove the whole thing, the whole sticker out of the, out of this backing so that you can line it up properly and you won't mess up that you know when you're trying to line it up it's like sticking onto your phone already so here goes nothing because I can't really see too good through this camera and this the screen on on my Lumix is way smaller than the screen on my Galaxy Note 9 so I'm lining up 
think I got this right there so you want to do that and then remove and hopefully see you don't have any uh, dust because if you'd have dust underneath your phone it's gonna show it as a bubble so hopefully there's no dust I'm gonna wipe this part up some more and make sure it's all lined up it seems like it's lined up so hope it is and it looks like I might be a little bit off from the top so I'm gonna do this and there you go so now it is on If you watch the D brand video, it they have like the they're using the microfiber cloth to do it <laughs> to like really smooth it uh smooth out the the skin onto the phone. But I'm not gonna do that right now. And see it matches because the Batman the Batman character here has a little bit of purple and that that'll go with this the the purplish or color gradient right there on the camera lens and so what I'm gonna do is uh, that's basically how you install it then you want to use a blow dryer to get the corners and things like that so I will do that so I'm gonna like stop the recording right here and then come back after I've uh, heated the sides with the blow dryer and then uh, we'll uh, put this on and see how it looks Okay, so I think I got it as smoothed out as I can get. And uh, so far, so good. Although I do notice, I don't know if it's showing on my camera. I think I there's a little there was a little dust particle that got in between Batman's eyes and nose. And it, I don't know if it's showing. And so it is a little bump right there. That's why I'm, I usually prefer doing this. In the bathroom with the shower turned to hot and no dust particles in the air but it looks good I don't know how long I'm gonna keep this Batman skin because I'm not really a Batman person I'm more of a Superman kind of guy so I'm gonna have this next I don't know when I'll install it probably within the next two three weeks I'll try to sport Batman as as long as I can along with this uh Batman bumper so let's uh let's put put the bumper on and see how it looks going side to side whoops like I said folks it's really not that easy trying to do it in in behind the camera And there you go. There's the bumper and Batman's face is covered. So I was not expecting that. So maybe I have to do it like this. Nope, Batman is still covered. So that is that. Okay, so I guess uh, Batman's face is going to be covered up regardless of how I put this. But all in all, I do like this skin, and I do like how it looks with this uh, Batman bumper, metallic bumper from Oats BASF. If you guys haven't seen the uh, unboxing, um, it's in. I'll put a link for that down below in the description. Uh, the other good thing with this skin is, even though this is the glossy version. There's a non-glossy and glossy version, like a matte version, and uh, this one is the glossy version, they call it. It still has pretty good grip. 
overall I mean it has a much better grip than your bare phone without a skin so whatever um, material or whatever vinyl that slick wraps has on this it's got good gripping on this back right here on this skin and um, it doesn't seem to attract smudges or fingerprints like right now uh, I don't have any fingerprints on this as you can see compared to like if I touch my screen protector see I'm already getting fingerprints right there but on this one no it's it doesn't attract fingerprints so that's another positive and so all in all I'm pretty happy um, these are the slick wraps um, superhero series skins or I, I, I believe they're called Helmatica let me make sure but I, if I'm not I'll, I'll put it in the description yeah, Slick Wraps calls it their Helmetica series, and so this one is the Batman version, and then I'll, I'm going to put the Superman version later on. If you guys are interested in that, let me know, and uh, I'll probably have it on this phone within the next two weeks or so. So that is it on this uh, follow-up on this Oats Bass Aluminum Metallic Bumper. They say it's a case, but it's not really a case because it doesn't really engulf the whole phone all the way through. Only the corners and the back. And with this uh, slick wrap skin, it's now complete as far as the look goes with the Batman theme. And even if I didn't use the uh, sticker for the uh, camera lens, it still looks pretty good. And like I said, it has good gripping and it doesn't attract smudges even though this is the glossy version. So that is that. So hope you guys learned something from this video on how to install these skins and uh, where to get them. And also the case. And if this video has informed and entertained or helped you out in any ways, please like and subscribe. Everybody take care. Have a great day and we'll see you soon for more videos. Dun, 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 dun.